big gains, lucky pause, and the Argantian Resolve. Guys, we could have started this video by saying lucky pause and nothing else. Huh? Huh? Really? Really now? Really now? I see you have done Really now, guys. <laughs> really, baby boy, brother boy, a brother man, really. <laughs> okay, GG, guys. We got some fortune action going on. We cash out fortune, and then we play Lucky Paws, and then we win the game, yeah. Does anyone else have Lucky Paws? Thank you. Oh, oh. No! 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 But he has no items that he took it. Really? You have a last whisper sword and you take lucky paws. That is disgusting, man. Aren't you too strong? Nah. He's good, but he's not that strong without items. Mm -mm. Ba ha 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 ha! Eighth! Ooh, guys, someone's giving us the bad mojo jojo, man. That is beautiful, guys. You know what we do with those people that give us the bad mojo jojo, man? We gotta believe, guys. We gotta believe. No eighth yet. We win those, guys. We win those. Uh, the best items on Kubuko should still be Bramble, Dragon Claw, and Redemption. But let me just check just to make sure. Uh, by the way, this augment got overbuffed. This is one of the best augments in the game. Um, no cap, I'm not kidding. This is one of the best augments in the game. Uh, there's tournaments going on right now. Everywhere. Big tournaments going on in TFT. Uh, in Europe and in NA. Uh, or not just NA, the Americas altogether. And, um, but the rest of the world as well, but that's what I'm watching, right? I'm watching the European and the NA tournaments. Or again, the Americas, they merge them together. And um, let me just put in the freaking filters here. And items, Delta, Talisman of Ascension. Uh, craftable, we do not have a Talisman of Ascension. Oh, Ionic Spark is better than Bramble Vest. Ionic Spark is better than Bramble Vest, guys. A6, it's not even that bad. Now the question is, do I want to play Bruiser here then? I don't think so. Okay, so I actually want... Um, not a Bramble Vest then. Hmm, I probably go for a Bramble Vest, because Bramble Vest is not that far away from the Ionic Spark. But Ionic Spark is truly way better than the Bramble Vest. The Bramble Vest has more sample size, yeah. But anyway, uh, basically the professional players are all complaining that the Garen carry augment and the Kobuku carry augment are way too broken. And uh, basically they, they, they literally have, some of them literally have in their stream title, playing tournament. Hopefully some lucky pause today. <laughs> like, you know, it's that broken. It's really egregiously broken. And yeah, let's see how we do, guys. You're not supposed to play it with fortune, but uh, I mean, if you find fortune, you find fortune. Let's see what we can do. We maximize our interest rate, and then we just roll down for this uh, little kubuko. The other guy is gonna do the same, though. We'll see how we do. That's insane, we get a cloak and it's a kubuko. That is just lovely, honestly. That is absolutely lovely. Can't believe it. So we get a Dragon Claw, we go Redemption, the percentage health healing, right? Uh, remember, Kubuko stacks up his maximum health. The more interest rate you earn, at 3 star he gets even more. 20 health per gold from interest rate that you earn every stage. Uh, permanent health. And then Lucky Paws just gives him a bunch more damage. And every time he kills an enemy, he gets he drops some gold as well. Oh, life is good. <laughs> life is good, isn't it, Kobuko, man? You cutie patootie. Look how cute he is. Look how happy he is, man. Oh, man, I wish I was like him. I'm always sad. I'm always so sad, guys, man. I'm always so sad. Why am I always so sad, guys? Why am I always so sad, guys? Anyway, so uh, the best thing we can get, by the way, is a Bruiser Emblem. Now, as you notice, probably, I rerolled my Augments twice this round. You can reroll Augments this game an extra time. 
So we have a very high chance to get a Bruiser Emblem. And if we get a Bruiser Emblem... We play a Bruiser and we win the game. It's that simple. But this guy is gonna have the same thing happen. Isn't he? Unfortunately. Unfortunately, guys. Let's see how it goes. Let's hope it goes well. For us. Okay, we have three bruisers so far. So the thing is, I need to loss streak for another four turns. So three turns, so I have to loss streak until 3-5. That's okay, though. Um, that's okay, though. That's okay, I get a big cash out. I can actually get an emblem, no? Can I not get an emblem? I think so. I'm getting five, then I'm getting... Uh, how, how do the intervals work? I'm getting five here, then I'm getting six or what? Or am I getting seven? I'm getting six next? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, like how does it work? If it's four more, five, six, I, I would get the, the thing. Yes, it's always five, six, seven, eight, okay. Are you sure though? I feel like this the increase is a little bit steeper later on. Depends on stage, okay. Okay, let's see how we do guys. Again, redemption is super important. I don't think we're losing this fight, right, guys? <laughs> right, guys? Guys, I don't think we're losing this fight, are we? <laughs> You're good, really, though? Nah, I'm good, I'm good. Nah, I'd win. Like, they one-shot them. Some farming money as well. I feel like I would have lost without the item, no? Like, high key, I would have lost without those items. My destination is clear. I want to roll too much. I want to roll too much. <clears throat> I want to stay at 50. How's the other Kabuko doing? He didn't roll much either. Oh, this guy's also playing one cost reroll. That's really good. So I go Ionic Spark, right? I try to get Ionic Spark. So what do I need? Three more? I'm getting six now. Six, seven, eight. Six, twenty-one, seven. Oh, I'm gonna be over 30. So I'm actually not gonna get an emblem. Thir 30, the 30 cash out. Like the 20 to 30, or what? what is it? No, it's 30 to 39, right? Or something like that? It's 30 to 39. 30 to 39 is Tome. Okay, yeah. If we get a Tome, we can get the Bruiser Emblem out of it. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. So we will get that. We will get the 30 to 39. We just go find Vintage and buff him up. I don't think buffing him up is that good though. Because, like, he always loses. Um, I mean, it's definitely not keepers. Exiles is good, no? Exiles is good. I mean, find Vintage is not good, man. It's over too good. I mean, isn't Exiles just good? Percentage health shield on bruisers. It's pretty good to me. Seems pretty good to me, man. Come, let me show you darkness. Okay. Okay. That's about it. Two more losses. You want to stay at 50 gold interest rate? And then we just roll down at level 5. Usually you would roll down on level 4. But this is okay. One more loss. We get a nice cash out. We roll down. We level up. We play 5 bruiser, 6 bruiser, 4 bruiser, whatever we get. 
Uh, there's an uh, encounter. Uh, what could it be? An artifact item and I get a beautiful ascension gem, ascension talisman. How does that sound, guys? Oh yeah, exiles, my bad. Honestly, it's, it's better to not have exiles. I don't want to lose. It's 40% chance for Tom. Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. It is artifact. Saying I'm sorry. I said I'm sorry, guys. <clears throat> I mean, yeah, I, I did just win. I did just win. Like, you, you can't lose with this, I think. This is beyond broken. You can't lose with this, guys. He wins every fight. You actually can't lose with this. I think this is Exodia. This is this is I think this is the the best the best Delta an item could have on him. Talisman of Ascension. 1.2k games. Delta minus 1.14. I have never seen something that is minus one point. <laughs> like, it's just absolutely broken. Uh, the Delta is the change in placement. On tactics or tools, they, they, they write del Delta is just change, right? That's what usually people use. When they talk about the change of something. In like physics or whatever. I think I just go Static Shift then, right? You just gotta kill everything with Static Shift. Or not, not him Static Shift, the backline unit has Static Shift. Like, probably I really are carry, right? I really are carry with Static Shift, Lakin. Okay, so let's not mess this up. Sell the, sell the Fortune Idiots. And then just roll for Kubuku. I'm not even gonna mark anything else, whatever, man. over guys pack it up guys gg pack it up fellas game's over well played to me ah oh, man what's up with you buddy only five kabukos where's your ascension talisman buddy bro why didn't you get the ascension talisman <laughs> You got a gambler's blade? Oh man, that's kind of unlucky. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Every river ends in me. Do you apologize? Do you apologize, guys? Holy frick, I'm so happy, guys. Isn't this the most fun you could have in this game? It's a carry augment, which are my favorite augments, right? My favorite augments in total. And then, like, it, it, it's freaking it's freaking the thing. Oh, yeah, Exiles, Exiles. Sorry, sorry. It, it's, it's freaking Ascension Talisman. Finally, man. So, um, as I was saying, um, if you have an Ascension Talisman on your Kobuko 3-star with Lucky Paws, it changes your average placement across all the games that are being tracked. Across all regions in, in that rank, right? In uh, Master and Up. Uh, on tactics or tools, right? Across all those games, this improves your placement. And again, Kobuko already has an insane average placement, right? Like again, if a, if a pro gets it, they just go first every time. He has 10k health. He has 10k health, guys. They go first place every single time, right? In the tournament or like top three at least, right? And I am... And this, this improves that placement, that average placement by... 1.1 so instead of averaging like a 3.8 or whatever right which is insane right because remember the average placement in a tft game is 4.5 because it's 1 to 8 right in the middle it's not 4 
it's 4.5. 4.5 is neutral. 4, you're gaining LP. 5, you're losing LP. 4.5 is... Obviously doesn't work, right? But if you play 20 games and you have a 4.5 average placement, you should have gained 0 LP, right? You should have gained 0 LP. I mean, I could play Teemo, but like, bro, for what? Like, for what? Do I go Ionic Spark anyway? Like, isn't it not even that bad? Like, what, what, like, who cares, right? Like, it's not even that bad. Like, bro, I'm not losing these fights anyway, though. Like, Ionic Spark is not even that bad. Like, it's, it's Silas, you know? But we do have this. Oh, yeah, it's Morello, it's Morello, you're right. It's Morello for sure. I'm trying I'm trying to go Adaptive Helm on Silas, right? Silas is your secondary carry, of course. You're playing 6 Bruiser, hopefully 8, if we get a Bruiser Emblem here. We have a pretty high chance, again, because we can reroll our Augment. Uh, but yeah, long story short, this Augment is beyond broken, guys. You should always take it. There is not a single challenger that wouldn't take it. It's absolutely broken. It's dominating the tournament. Uh, the Garen carry Augment, just as broken. I think this one's better, though, even. I think this one's a little bit better, but like it doesn't really matter, they're both beyond broken, you should always take them. He did 28,000 damage. <laughs> I mean, isn't Cyberbolt pretty good? Ah, I don't give a freak, man. Ah, oh, mustard, mustard. No prison can hold me. Musty mustard, mustard. Mustard, guys. Uh, what could this be? Could be blotters on him, but I don't really like it. This story. I don't really like Bloodthirster on Silas, but honestly, it's fine. It's, it's not as good, though. Like, there's better items, for sure. In my opinion, Crown Guard, Adaptive Helm, and uh, Ionic Spark is the best. It's not even just my opinion, it's the statistics, right? I'm, I just play according to the math. But Bloodthirster is fine, for sure. It's okay. Especially if you're not playing Sage. It's fine, right? It's fine. Bloodthirster probably is fine. Angar for Spark, no, it's gonna be Adaptive Helm instead of Spark. We have Static Shield. Static Shield is really good on Irelia. She applies it very often. I know she's a physical damage dealer, but she's just the support in this comp. Syra grants you three copies of it. Isn't this pretty good? I mean, you know, blue buff is good on Silas. Like, it's actually good. Ah, blue buff is good on Silas. Just pop it, man. Like, we won the game anyway. Like, now it's all about reaching level 9 and winning the game. Bro, this is just sad. Like, I feel so bad for him, man. Like, what the frick is this, man? Like, I actually feel bad for him. He didn't even get a Bramble Vest. He has a Titans, man. He has a freaking Titans. Like, like what the frick is this? At least he got well fed. But come on, man. How can you get this unlucky? It's not even fair. Like, bro, there's so many Kobukos, and he can't even 3-star it just because I have one. It's so sad for him, man. Like, it's actually just so sad, bro. Like, if I were in his position and I would see the enemy have this, I would be so mad. I would probably rage quit for today. I would rage quit. I'll be playing Balasho as we speak. But luckily I'm not. <laughs> I'm the winner. I'm the winner, guys! <laughs> Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Sorry. I think I'm just going Death Blade, I really are, right? I'm going Death Blade, I really are, what? Death Blade, Morello, 
Static Shift can go on somebody else. It's not that bad. If I play that really, I can go Infinity Edge for now on her. Uh, that ain't bad. If that is not bad, yes. And that is not bad. Look how much gold we're farming, man. The freaking Koboko is so broken. Like, why does he also farm uh, gold, man? Like, why does he also farm gold? Like, come on, man. Like, he's just... He's just... He, he's just so broken, and then he also farms gold. I mean, I'm happy. I love these... Like, again, the pros are all complaining about these carry augments because they are really broken. <laughs> I surrender. Uh, they're really broken, right? But, uh... You know... Hey, hey, I didn't farm money! Hey, wait 10 seconds. I didn't farm money because of you, man. I could have farmed like five gold off of you. You piece of garbage, man. <laughs> Frick you, buddy, man. Frick you, brother, man. Frick you, man. Frick that guy, man. No, as I was saying, um, I love these carry augments, though. So I love, I love this. I love this. This is super fun. They should probably nerf them a little bit, but like, bro. Like, these are absolutely broken, man. Nico summons a 5 cost spirit. Sure. Good luck, buddy. I can play her. Maybe I can farm some items. It's not even that bad. It's not even that bad. It's kind of bad, though. It's not even that bad, though. Some oh, call I me evil. Shall I prove them right? I can just do that. So why didn't I give her Shoujin and Nashers too? I am stupid, guys. For what? I'm already winning anyway. Like, why don't you just prioritize farming items, you freaking idiot, man? That was actually so stupid. It probably doesn't matter, but you know, it could matter. Who knows, bro? Sell a Zir. You can't sell a Zir, guys. Oh my god, man. This freaking... Hugo is so insane. Like, how is this even possible, man? 16k health? Just look at this guy. He just slaps them for like 500 damage. Five, five. Bro, he just does 12k damage per ult. He's doing 12,000 damage per ult, man. Like, bro, his, his damage scales with health. So this doubles his health. But then it also... So it doubles his damage. But then it also gives him 120% increased damage. Also, I don't have Static Shift now. Am I dumb as frick, guys? Yes, I am, man. Yes, the frick I am. Like, what? I don't have Static Shift now. Am I stupid, guys? Am I stupid, though? Yeah. How is he gaining Perma HP? He has a passive that gives him... The more interest rate you earn, the more... Um, permanent health he gets. What am I doing? Stick to the plan. We have a plan. Guys, I'm lost. I'm freaking lost, guys. Guys, I'm lost. I'm freaking lost. Do I, do I have another bow that isn't static ship? I can go Ionic Spark, right? Okay, psh, I have it figured out. We go uh, Ionic Spark on Silas. <sighs> and instead we get uh, a red buff on Irelion. Instead of Static Ship. Instead of Morello. Red buff on Irelion. This is just ridiculous, man. This is just silly, guys. Look at this. Well, I might actually lose, though, because he has to ult the freaking Sand Soldiers. I'm actually losing, because the overtime. Oh, great. Oh, man. You think I'll lose the game? No, right? No way. Nah, I don't believe it. Wait. The freaking Sand Soldiers. The Soldier Boys, man. Right. 
I lose another fight, I have to commit, right? Like, I want to get maximum interest right now. Do I just use this because I don't really need this duplicator anyway? On any unit, I have everything 2-star that I need. This guy's a 2-star Udyr, it's kind of scary, man. Like, it's kind of scary. Oh, Who am I ditching, by the way? Which bruiser am I ditching for sure? Wait, am I actually losing? Am I stupid? I thought I'm like giga safe, man. Like, I can't lose at all. Brother, can you stop dancing for like 50 minutes? Okay, I have to commit, bro. Like, I have to commit. Is it even my fault? Guys, don't kill me, man. Don't kill me, guys. Ah, but I have 16 health. Like, I, I have to commit. No, I need Irelia. I need Irelia 1 at least. I need Irelia 1. I need Irelia 1. Uh, I need Irelia. I need Huey 2. I need to play Umbral. Eh, not Umbral. Honestly, Umbral Emblem is good here. Can I get it? Oh, thank you guys. Umbral Emblem is pretty good, no? So what do we do? Uh, wrap off Irelia? Wrap off Deathblade Umbral Emblem or what? Wrap off Deathblade Umbral Emblem? Am I on Spark? I need Crown Guard, I need this Morello to be sold. The power of a dragon! The spirits I feel Where the trick is my Irelia, man? No prison to hold me. Bro, I don't need Rakan. I mean, I guess I just play Rakan. Hello? You ready for me? Like, okay, what so the frick is this, man? Hello, brother! I need my freaking Irelia. She's so much better than these trash lords. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. I think I'm freaking dead. I'm freaking, I think I'm freaking dead. He's the only one left alive. He's gonna take too long again. The Azir is gonna create sand soldiers. I think I'm freaking dead! He's wasting his time! found one I really are after like 15 money. Like, how is this even a thing, man? I can't believe it, guys. Okay, I finally have Exalted. And I have Irelia. I need to sell this. Get the freaking Umbral Emblem. 
onto the thing. I could also go mythic, three mythic. It's not that bad. I have freaking exalted finally. Like the, the thing is, the thing that's gated by him is just the overtime, right? He dies in overtime. Holy frick, that was close. Guys, I rolled 700 gold for one I really are. I actually cannot believe it. That is wild, guys. That is wild. I'm pretty sure this doesn't stop uh, exiles, right? This doesn't stop, stop exiles. Yeah, it doesn't. Uh, the Kale does not stop exiles. Paint fades. Printer. Uh, what am I doing here? Mythic, maybe? Can I level? I can exactly level. So how do I position this? I can't use items yet. I need I need money to buy something and sell it. Okay, please win this, man. Like, what the frick is even happening? My Irelia is dead already, but it's fine, right? The Silas is alive. Bro, the, the Azir is the number one counter to this. Because he f creates these sand soldiers that always take three seconds to kill because this guy spends three seconds dancing. Okay? I did not think that I had to roll until level 10. The thing is, I have to position like this. Thieves love on who? Holy way. Oh nice. Okay, I hope we win this. Oh my god, he killed my freaking guy. He killed my freaking Ionic Spark. It's fine, I have static ship. Please, man, like I, uh, I, I didn't expect, like I, I had to, I made a lot of mistakes because I thought I'm fine, you know? I don't have to roll yet, but I had to roll, bro. I lost to level 8! Guys, was this the worst fight you've ever seen, though? Was this the worst freaking garbage fight you've ever seen? He just Zephyrs my Kobuko. But even with the Zephyr Kobuko, like, what the frick is happening, man? Guys, did you expect that we have to roll a single time? Legendary throw. Yeah, it's a throw. Like I'm saying, I made a lot of mistakes because I didn't expect to be in a position. I thought I'm cruising to level 10 with my eyes closed. Not a single loss. But the Azir's just giga countered me, man. I lost to a level 8 player. This is ridiculous, though. This should not be happening. This is ridiculous. This was probably the worst fight RNG you can imagine, right? Because why is my I really are dead, right? My I really are just dies out of nowhere. And also, um, you can say throw, absolutely. But uh, if, the, if the RNG late game wasn't bottom barrel, the most bottom barrel RNG I've ever seen, I rolled like 120 gold at level 9 to find a one single Irelia. I would not lose these fights if I had a single Irelia. I would have not lost a single fight if I had an Irelia earlier. And if I had a two-star Irelia, I would be able to walk away from my PC and just win for free, right? Guys, we'll still take it though. That was extremely fun. I got flabbergasted. I did not think that I would get uh, blasted there even a single time. But the Azir is insane, huh? Just makes, th makes this guy waste his time dancing around. And then the overtime, just overtime, everyone deals th triple, quadruple damage, right?
And then we could have played, uh, I'm, I'm sure at level 10 we could play better stuff. Like, for example, Rakan, right? Rakan Soraka. Like, why am I playing Lilia and Nautilus for Mythic? Like, come on, man. I should have played Rakan and Soraka. I get Altruist. That's the only thing that matters, right? We get more resistances, obviously, right? But again, I was flabbergasted. Subscribe, ring the bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time.